One, two, three, let's go. Wednesday afternoon, hoping you will tune into our show. It's hosted by Cuz. Welcome back to the Football Referee with Emmy Hickens, Trevor Gear, and Femi Mandariola. Not so much passing out from the back this season because that teams have come a cropper doing that but so there's not so much a long ball but I think the goalkeeper will throw or kick the ball out to someone on his wing things like that much more than this messing around at the back and then eventually one of them has to hoof it upfield yeah so that seems to be changing as well but uh yeah, I think uh, I, I like the way football's played because end-to-end -end football is what we need to see. Um, and you don't really want to see ultra-defensive teams going out not to lose rather than going out to try and win. Yeah. And there's a, there's a subtle difference in that in terms of what positions players are playing in and what sort of players they are picking. Yeah, but yeah I, I, th I think uh, going back, to, I think Dominic Solanke He's more of a traditional centre forward, but even there, he puts himself about a bit more than an old centre forward type would do. He yeah. does get into other positions as well, and he's—I think he's very quick, and he'll take. He generally he'll take the chances that come across to him. Yeah. So yeah, I, I'm a fan of his. At one point, he nearly—it was rumoured he might come to Palace before he went to Bournemouth, right. and it didn't happen. I don't know whether he didn't want to come to Palace or whatever. But uh, yeah, I, I was sorry at the time that he didn't come to Palace because we needed a regular goal scorer, as yeah. many teams do, of course. Does it? Does, I think he plays for. Uh, I think he plays for Tottenham now, doesn't he? He does. He plays. Oh, right, for, yeah. He plays for Tottenham. Oh, right. Yeah, he went to. He came from Bournemouth, didn't he? Right. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't mean to imply he's still playing for Bournemouth. Yeah, but I was just thinking he plays for Tottenham. Yeah, but I think they played. No, they didn't play Bournemouth. I thought they played Bournemouth at the weekend, and I thought I saw him on sports side. But yeah, yeah. He, he, but Man City, Man City lost to Bournemouth, didn't yeah, they? Yeah, that's it. Yeah, man, it was Man yeah. City that lost to Bournemouth. Yeah, yeah. So you know, it'll, it'll sort of create a problem, won't it? Because I mean, who do you who do you substitute for that? Um, I mean, I'm looking at I'm looking at the England team, and I'm looking at Declan Rice, I'm looking at Jude Bellingham, and I'm looking at. Um, um, what's this our player that plays in uh, the, the German league, Borussia Dortmund? Harry Kane. So yeah. now Harry Kane, uh, Declan Rice, and uh, Jude Let's Bellingham. Uh, right. So who, who are they going to substitute for him? This is what I'm thinking. Well, yeah. What do you mean? If if Solanke was to come in, yeah, who if he was would to he... come in, yeah, yeah. And who are they going to take off? Who, who, who's who's yeah. he going to take? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Well, I think that's the point. He he would be a sub. He'd probably be an impact sub right, if things yeah. aren't going well, or yeah. if if someone's tired or got a bit of a knock. Um, so he could come on for any one of them in that sense. I, I don't see him as a Jude Bellingham type player. No. I, certainly, I think maybe a Harry Kane type player. If you know Harry. We're going to take a short break now. The Football Ref will be back shortly. You're listening to The Football Referee with Emmy Hickens, Trevor Gear, and Femi Madariola. The Football Referee will be back shortly. Please stay tuned. The Football Referee is looking for sponsors. If you're a business out there looking to spread the word about the products and services you offer, please get in touch on our website, deepstuffrecords.com. And also, if you're looking to get involved on this show, please reach out via our Facebook page, Deep Stuff Radio or Deep Stuff Records. Thank you. Say hello to old Mimi, Dr. Gladys and Rose, three beautiful ladies who join us on our shows. There's one other bro, sometimes joins us on the show. His contributions thoughtful and smart. Femi is his name. He likes to play our game, and his smart solutions come right from the heart. 